Hatanda rotisto bohita. Kretisto pohika mantos kele distarabo. Ne kekiska i hama ha ha hi. Tukuta hepa koto. Ligri kutuka pika pi. It is written. It was a freedom that Christ set free. Every marauding forces, I command you to hell in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I bind you and cast you back to hell in the name of Jesus. Everyone under my voice that have been bound, that have been made captive, oppressed by evil spirit, you are loose in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. If sickness is yours, I say, you and the infirmity you are separated from today. Receive sight if you are blind. Receive hearing if you are deaf and dumb. Loose your tongue in the name of Jesus Christ. Every part of your body that is dead, receive life. Stand up if you are with your uh, uh, paralyzed in the name of Jesus and walk. I decree your heart, your lungs, your kidney, your livers, every organ inside you. Be healed in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. If you have someone that is sick, as you believe God for them, at this hour, they are free from their infirmity. They are free from their sicknesses. I have the glory of God to surround them. Release your power, Lord Jesus Christ, upon them. Every demon of hell under my voice. The Bible says the stranger shall be with it. I will you in the name of Jesus. He says they will run out. 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 He karamasa. They will run out. Strangers, run out in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. The marriages that you step your feet into, I break your power over them and I lose love back into those homes. In the name of Jesus, I restore back those marriages. In the name of Jesus, people that you have held bound, made barren, I bless them in the name of the Lord. You are fruitful in Jesus' name. The Bible says, no shall be barren. You are not barren. You are healed. Receive fruit of the womb in the name of Jesus. People who are doing business and you have been blocking them, you have been hindering them today, you are a marauding force. You have been done away with I prophesy to those businesses, tomorrow shall be a dawn of fulfillment for you. It shall be a new day when things will move fast. And that which you hope shall become reality, it will be given to your hand. Unto he who had made provision before vision comes, and who said in the book of Ephesians, chapter 1, verse 3 to 4, 2. It says, we have been richly blessed in the heavenly places. I call for riches of heaven into full manifestation. Resources to fulfill dream, receive it. Wisdom, which is not physically seen. Knowledge, which cannot be contested. Understanding, received from the heavenlies in the name of Jesus. Unction to turn your ability to produce well. Receive it from this hour as you leave my presence. Wonders, wonders, wonders. You enter into the wonders of God. According to what he had promised you in the book of Isaiah. You will know it is the Lord thy God who had done these wonders for you. In chapter 45 of Isaiah, it says, Thus said the Lord to you, whatever your name is, I put Alfred there, to you whose right hand the Lord has lifted up to subdue nations. As you go in this week, the Lord will lift up your right hand, you will subdue nations. And it says that I will go before him and level the mountains. The Lord will go before you this week and level the mountains. He will open the double doors before you. He will break down the gates of bronze and cut through the bars of iron. He will give you the treasures of darkness and the riches stored in secret places. And then he will restore back your fortune. And people will know that it's the Lord thy God who had summoned you by his name. Never again will you be put to shame, says the Lord. Ashes turn to beauty. Father, we bless you. In Jesus' holy and anointed name we have prayed. Amen.